Got it. Got it. It's going to be good. Okay. Okay, so 1 John chapter 3 verse 1. It says, See what an incredible quality of love the Father has bestowed, given to us, bestowed on us, that we should be permitted to be named and called and counted the children of God. Okay, the King James says the sons of God. And so we are. Uh, Now, the last part of this verse is something that I really want to emphasize on. It says, the reason that the world does not know, recognize and acknowledge us is that it does not know, recognize and acknowledge Him. So, uh, for many years reading that scripture, I always thought when it speaks about recognizing us and recognizing Him, that the relation was with Jesus. So I think to a ex- certain extent it is. But if you read the scripture from the top, it says, Behold what men of love the Father has bestowed on us. So the Father uh, is, is what hasn't been recognized. <laughs> okay, so now remember when, when Jesus uh, appeared on earth. Now remember in human form. Uh, the Bible says God in flesh, the word in flesh. So when Jesus came walking on earth, he was the, 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 the expression of his father. So John chapter 14, he stands in front of the disciples and Philip says to him, Lord, show us the father. And Jesus said to him, have I been with you so long and you do not know and recognize and see me yet? Okay. So in other words, okay, Jesus went on to explain that he's in the father, the father's in me. But Jesus' whole mission on earth was to make His Father visible, was to make the Father revealed to to the world, to the people. He was revealing the nature of God Himself. All right, so it's amazing if you if you read the book of First John, uh, it says that God is love. So, so now we know from uh, Hebrews chapter one. Verse 3 it says that Jesus is the perfect imprint, the expression of the Father. Okay, But now uh, 1 John also explains that God is love. So describing the, 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 the nature of God is mentioned and all wrapped up in this word love. So 1 John chapter 4, it says nobody at any time has ever seen God. But if we love one another, and I'm just going to stop the verse there. If, if, if you take the word love, and uh, according to 1 John, God is love. Okay, So love puts substance to God. Love is what makes God visible. So it's like uh, I've got this leather Bible. Okay, Now this Bible has got paper. A lot of paper and then leather on the outside. Okay, if, if the substance of the Bible, of the pages here, is paper. <laughs> so, if I want a Bible, I need the paper. Okay, so this Bible is paper. So, if I take the paper away, there's no Bible. If I take the leather away, there's no cover. So, the substance, the paper puts substance to what to my intention which is I want a Bible okay and then you've got the complete thing so this is a Bible but this is paper so when we love one another according to 1 John chapter 4 when we love we we make God visible we we, we put substance uh, we bring a substance that makes God tangible okay so still today so 1 John 3 says behold what manner of love the Father has bestowed on us, that we should be called the sons of God. So the Father bestows His love on us, and and it's it's I guess it's it's like saying the Father wants to show show Himself to the whole world. The Father, Jesus, wants to show Himself to people. So the moment that we take that expression, when we realize, wow, I'm loved by my Father. Uh, It brings a revelation uh, to people that they can see God. All right. So, yeah. So, like, uh, is it Hebrews chapter 11? It says, Now faith 
is the substance of things hoped for. So like faith will bring substance to to like promises or things that we need uh, in order to get to get those to manifest you need faith now in order to get God to manifest it's just love it's receiving the love of the Father so what Jesus was doing he said I can only do what I see my father doing I can only do what I see my father doing he goes uh, John 14 he says the works that I do it's not my works, it's the Father in me who does these works. Alright, so Jesus' whole intention was to reveal the Father to the world. Now today, I believe God wants the same. God is trying, while well, God is desperate for people to see His love. And He's chosen His sons to do it. So like Jesus revealed the Father. And if you read through the scriptures, the Father revealed Him as His Son. You don't need to go out and reveal yourself as a son of God. Okay, that's why it says, Behold what manner of love the Father bestowed on us. So the Father reveals us as His sons. Alright? And we, as sons, have a responsibility to reveal the Father to the world. Amen? So that's all I had to share with you. And I'm sure you got something awesome out of it. So, bless you.